Hey y'all, Irix guy here, and I want to demonstrate the new uh, case that I'm using for the DJI Phantom 4. As you can see here, it's got a handle on the top. If you want to carry it this way. It's also got a handle on this end if you want to carry it this way. And then it's got, to make things better, it's got wheels. So if you're rolling through an airport or other place, it's got wheels. And to make it better, this right here pops. That pops out, it locks. You've got a handle that you can use to roll it. Super duper convenient. And obviously when it's not, uh, when the handle's not in use, it goes back in, it locks to prevent it from popping out and potentially breaking off during transport. Uh, to make things better, you've got a hole there and a hole there. If you want to put a TSA approved lock on it, I'll let TSA get in and, uh, and not have to know your password or your combination for your lock rather or your uh or have a key this right here is really neat these will pop open these this is a press uh, pressure release valve but you can lock it thumb lock it again that's not locking it to keep people out like the locks would be but that just better ensures that it likely won't pop open during transport and then when you get inside here's where you've really got the goodness you can configure this any way that you choose to do so I did it quite simply. So what I did, I put my Phantom 4 controller over here in the side. I've got my iPod Touch here. And again, check the link within this video's description. You can find the case, the iPod Touch model that I'm using, the case for the iPod Touch. Works great for the Phantom 4, by the way. It's my preferred uh, device to fly with. It's small, lightweight, and uh, really easy to see screen. And then I've got the middle where I've got my Phantom 4 and I've got the camera guard on here and it's uh, I mean it just fits look at that and see it's not going to wiggle back and forth now obviously like any other case that you may be considering before you close your case you want to make sure that none of this is going to make contact with the hard plastic because you could potentially damage your motors and obviously this fits the Phantom 4 like a glove so you know no problems there over here, I've got my insanely long iOS cable. I've got to get another short one. I've got them, uh, check the link within this video's description. I've got them there, but they're just, uh, I, I lost mine. I don't know if it was stolen or fell out or what, but, and then over here, I've got my props. I've got two sets of Phantom 4 props in my little prop sack. So just a very convenient way to transport your Phantom. So whether you're going to and from the field, you know, maybe you're traveling. This is optimal when you're traveling because it doesn't matter who it is, more than likely someone is not going to take as good a care as as you would with your product. So, you know, if you're traveling, somebody may get this and they may just kind of throw it around. They, uh, they may, uh, just really abuse it, you know. And I mean, this case is built to take abuse. I mean, I've got a, a very expensive Phantom 4 in there and I, I trust it. I trust it enough to swim with it. Although obviously not recommended, I do swim with my case because there's a lot of, of filming scenarios where I've got to get out of the boat and there's no way to get to shore. You know, I don't have my dinghy with me. I've got to swim. So, you know, this is handy from that perspective. So just a really good really good case and just to show since I was tossing that around let's see if we broke anything nope it's all still there and that's a testament of this high quality uh, foam inside here that just keeps it keeps it good and safe so I like this case it comes in other colors too check the link within this video's description you can find where to order it online and uh, be sure to subscribe youtube.com forward slash iRixGap thanks for watching and Y'all have a good day. Hey y'all, Irix Guy here. I wanted to take a moment to thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel. I'm an independent channel, and it's viewers like you that help me to continue to grow. I appreciate your viewership, and y'all have a good day.